Welcome back to the channel. Let's explore together. Today we are checking out Brandon Rogers again. This time he says he watched Squid Games so you don't have to. Well, thanks Brandon. I have been meaning to not watch Squid Games for some time, but let's see what horrendous synopsis you've come up for us. Come up with for us. Oh, I can imagine this is going to be uh, terrifyingly inappropriate. So you have been warned uh, right now. Leave if you're uh, if you're squeamish or offended. It's it's Brandon Rogers. It's going to get bad. So uh, also, if you do like this kind of stuff, comment below and then subscribe. So you'll be notified when we get to whatever things you want me to check out in the comments. Here we go. My name is Helen Brownstein, and I watched that squirt game, so you don't gotta. So we got squirt game. A Gihan, who is a who average teenager, is in one of them sugar mama situations. No, I did not know there were subtitles. I just had to bear back the whole thing in straight Korean. So Gi <laughs> didn't know there were subtitles. <laughs> bear back it in straight Korean. He says, "Oh my god these characters that brandon portrays situations no i did not know there were subtitles i just had to bear back the whole thing and i've heard that the and i've seen clips of the english dub is just tremendously bad so if i ever watch this i know i'm just watching with subtitles that english dub is embarrassing i don't think when they made it they thought the show would be as popular as it was clearly they might want to just redo that english dub straight Korean. So Guy is on the hunt for children. He goes and teases this little bitch, but ends up taking this one home, whom he equips with a firearm before sending her back to her parents. I know, I was hoping that's where it ended. So now we got one. I was hoping that's where it ended. <laughs> one of them business twigs who wants to go and diddle gi -hun's hole, and gi -hun starts his, no, I'm a fight. We're gonna argue over which condom is the safest. Daddy G wins a golden ticket to the PlayStation factory. That's the golden ticket to the PlayStation factory. I mean, it do look like that, though. Little bitch he stole evolved into a full-grown cockeyed robo who <laughs> shoots. <laughs> I'm not used to hearing a Brandon Rogers skit with censorship. Shoots down anyone who looks like they're gonna steal her again. Yeah, I remember that soup. Now this one's called saying woo. I don't know what that means, and therefore I'm offended. No one. <laughs> Uh, this is more rooted in like an actual somewhat synopsis than I thought it would be. I mean, I mean, I know the plot points are just random, but um, it's 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 for for Brandon Rogers. This is extraordinarily tame. One even fucks the old guy. I always and now that one wasn't censored. <laughs> One's called saying "woo." I don't know what that means, and therefore I'm offended. No one even fucks the old guy. I always knew PlayStation people were perverts, but this just seals the deal. <laughs> it was a bathroom lesbian scene. Human anal beads. I mean, these human anal beads. People know how to party. We, <laughs> we all know the circle people are bottoms. I give squirt games. The circle people are bottoms. Okay. I mean, these people know how to party. We all know the circle people are bottoms. I give squirt games eight Helens. Squirt games gets eight Helens. There you go, guys. It's not just your typical gay romance. It is an in-depth ex. It's not a typical gay romance. <laughs> as they show a seemingly gay romance scene. Expose at the heart Well, unwanted gay romance. It looked like- It's not just your typical gay romance. It is an in-depth expose at the hard work PlayStation employees go through to produce all those violent video games I confiscate from my students. <laughs> oh, this is as good as any thumbnail moment with, uh, with old girl Helen. Just a little bit of a- uh... Hey, if you're here for the thumbnail moments, let me know. And if any of you fucking students are watching this right now, I better see you in class on time this month between November 9th and the 13th. I am coming to Boston, New York, Philly, DC, and Oh, uh, good tour announcement. I think, yes, it's a real city, and you can get your tickets at brandonwatcherslive.com. Now, I don't think any of those cities are close to me. You in class on time. I didn't hear Chicago at all. I'm this month between November 9th and the 13th. I am coming to Boston, New York. Yeah, it's an East Coast thing. DC and Red Bank. Yes, it's a real city. Well, well go if you can. I'm sure it'd be an amazing show. You can get your tickets at brandonwatcherslive.com. Now I gotta put something in my ass. <laughs> gotta put something in your ass. All right, well. There was a Brandon Rogers promo, and now we now we don't have to watch Squid Games. Uh, Helen recommends it, but now I feel like I understand everything. <laughs> Until we explore again. We'll see you next time.